Hello viewers, I am Anuranjan Burman and uh, I am going to discuss briefly about the anatomy of heart. The heart is a concept, the hollow muscular organ. The size of your heart is same with the size of your fist. Your heart lies in the thoracic cavity in the mediastinum. Do you know what is mediastinum? The mediastinum is a space between the two lungs. The heart has a base above and the apex below. The heart has specialized muscle called cardiac muscle which are involuntary in the reaction. The wall of the heart has three layers of tissue known as pericardium, myocardium and endocardium. The pericardium is the outermost layer and is made up of two sacs. The outer sac is known as fibrous pericardium, consists of fibrous tissue and the inner sac is known as serous pericardium, which has a double layer of serous membrane. There is a fluid present in between the two serous membrane, which is known as pericardial fluid. The middle layer is the myocardium. The myocardium is composed of specialized cardiac muscle found only in the heart. These muscles are straighted like skeletal muscle, but it is not under voluntary control. The innermost layer of the heart is known as endocardium and it lines the chambers and valves of the heart. The endocardium is a very thin and smooth membrane to ensure the smooth flow of blood through the heart. The heart is divided into right and left side by a septum consists of myocardium covered by endocardium. The heart has four chambers. On the right side, there is right atrium above and the right ventricles below. On the left side, there is left atrium above and the left ventricles below. Now let's talk about the valves of the heart. Pulmonary valve is present at the opening of the pulmonary artery. This valve prevents the backflow of blood into the right ventricles when ventricular muscle relaxes. Then the tricuspid valve. Tricuspid valve separate the right side of the heart into the right atrium above and the right ventricles below. It has three flaps or cusps. That's why it is known as tricuspid valve. Next is the aortic valve. Aortic valve is present at the opening of the aorta and it prevents backflow of blood into the left ventricle. The last one is the bicuspid valve. Bicuspid valve separate the right side of the heart into left atrium above and the left ventricles below. It has two flaps or cusps. So it is known as bicuspid valve. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and comment. And those who are new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.